Hey, how's it going? Good. I am picking up turtle bedding that got cool. Oh, sure, yeah, totally. Uh, Andy, the turtle bedding. Yeah. Can I ask you a question? This yeah. is, is this totally weird? I was gonna give this to my girlfriend. She's really afraid of snakes. Does that like, is that close enough to like snakes? Oh, that's supposed to look like snakes. Well, like they're kind of like snakes, but they're not snakes. I would say no. Not, not so good? No. Okay. I was going to say it's a nice. Um, she gets grossed out by snakes, so I thought this would be just like. Let's think. Yeah. Little guys. Okay. Let's see what you're going for. Yeah, because they're a little bit less snake like and they're more caterpillar y. Oh, God. You know? So I thought, you know, like, but would Wait. you still. Would you be afraid of that if you were afraid of snakes? I'm like a little bit afraid of that. What did you just do? Yeah, when they stand up on their end like this, they're, they stay stiff and you can light their little horns. Uh. They can only burn for about 10 seconds. They're called candelas, Bolivian candelas. It's like a thing they do for birthday celebrations in Bolivia. You did not just light those on fire. Yeah, you can light the little tip. Yeah, we get a whole case of them in here. So once they go into hibernation, we were gonna like sell them as the candles, and then they only work when they're stiff like that. Really? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna get these guys back in. Once they start moving again, they won't do that again until the season hits. When they get scared, they'll stay perfectly stiff. The same thing we do when we perk up. And then that becomes, that, that's a receptor that if you touch it, it won't, it has no nerve endings in it. That's why you can light it. And then once they feel the heat, you put them down on something else. But, yeah, but I just don't want her to freak out when I was showing it to her. So yay or nay on these, I mean, I shouldn't do it. She might freak out. Yeah? yeah. All right, let me go grab your bedding. Okay. You don't need a bag, you just carry it like that? Yeah. Yeah, we were gonna work with the restaurant next door to do like a whole cake of them and like do like a video and try and like <laughs> work with them, yeah. Cause it's really, it's really hard to like link reptiles with desserts. Sure. In any other way. Sure. But yeah, they stay, they're frightened like that and that response that they have, that's called the Carbonaro effect. Okay. Have you heard of that before, no. the Carbonaro effect? It's the name of a hidden camera magic TV show that you are on right now. I still can't tell if you're with me or not. I mean, I know you're Now I am telling you the truth. This is a hidden camera magic TV show right now. I'm a magician. I mean, I believe that you're okay. a magician. You okay? Thank you. Yeah. But look, I have a camera hiding right up there. Is that one? I do. See that camera hiding right up there? I do. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm Michael Carbonaro. What's your name? Christine. Christine. That was pretty hard to believe. Yeah, I was like, I mean, I was like, you're f with it. <laughs> it was like back For and forth. Sure. You were wrestling it. You were like, I was like, no but like, I was like, wait, was it? <laughs> oh my god. And I was like, no. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Well, here, that's for you. No, thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>